All right, what's up guys? Grind season outdoors, back with another video. I'm just gonna talk to you guys while I kind of get some, well, let me grab my rods quick. I'll be right back. All right, let me first start off by saying, yeah, I realize I look like a goon. I completely forgot my chesty, so repping the old head mount right now, which I'm not a huge fan of, but I'm gonna give it a shot because I'm trying to put together a video, but let me wait for this truck to go by, it's really loud. Anyway, let me start by saying this. It's snowing hard right now. There was no snow on the ground yesterday. There was no snow on the ground six hours ago. Out of nowhere, it just started snowing. And then, I got a story for you guys. So I watched Sam Sobey's video where he was greasing some, some northern pike on the Mississippi up near Minneapolis. And we're in northeast Iowa right now. He found open water. So I came to the Mississippi. I'm like, I'm going to find open water. I came yesterday with only 20 minutes of daylight. Found this tiny little pocket here. I mean, tiny. There's ice. This whole slough, as far as you can go, is frozen. And then there's this one pocket of open water. And I don't know why it's open. I don't know if, I don't know if there's like warm water feeding into it from somewhere. But this one little corner's opened up. So I came in last night, had maybe 20 minutes to fish. Get this. Come in. I'm like, I'm just gonna try to find a northern. White and chartreuse chatterbait. First cast, two pounder. Second cast, lost a three. Third cast, lost another one. Fourth cast, lost another one. Realized my hook on my chatterbait was garbage. Went and switched chatterbaits, caught five more fish. All bass, literally, like who would have thought they were hitting moving baits. This whole area is frozen up. I found open water. So I'm back. I've got more time this time. Right now, show you what I got rigged up. Got a white and chartreuse chatterbait. Got the old sexy shad KVD jerkbait. Red eye shad, red craw, lipless, delta craw, whatever they call that color. I mean, we're just gonna give it a go. I'm just so jacked up, dude. Grind season outdoors, we're back. We're finding open water. It's bass fishing time. I've had a photo shoot all morning for some different companies and I was doing that and now, now I get to have a little fun and celebrate. We're gonna see if we can catch some. I'm gonna get the old cringy head mount going and you're gonna come with because grind season outdoors is back. We're better than ever. snow yesterday when I was here and it was 10 degrees warmer so no idea what's gonna happen you can see already getting some slush on the water out there you can see where the snow is is where the ice was at all this stuff was open water but it's kind of starting to slush and might be trying to freeze back up but let's see if we can't get down here and smack a couple god that makes me so happy I'm gonna go with the white and chartreuse chatterbait to start. That's what they really seemed to want yesterday, so. Caught a majority of my fish right where I just threw that one, so. I don't know, you guys, this, uh, this little cold front and snowstorm that came in might have. might have shut these fish off it's like 30 degrees right now it was 45 degrees when I was fishing yesterday it was 10 15 degrees warmer but I'm gonna film see if we can smack one oh 
yes hit it right at shore of course this truck had to drive by right when i caught one hope you guys can see that real small not even a pound but like i said i caught a I caught a two and two and a half and lost a three yesterday so right at shore i know i know it was probably a pound and i'm over exaggerating but they're in here that's all i know Ranked it. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, let's go. God, that fish is thick. That fish is built. That's a two pounder all day. Look at our shoulders. I hope you guys can see that all right, but man, that thing cranked it. Get him back. Alright. I'm gonna go get the... Since I caught two in like a matter of four casts right there. I'm gonna go ahead and run and grab the big camera and see if we can. See if we can get some footage on there. Hopefully I can catch a fish for you guys. On the big camera now I got sick of... I already got sick of wearing the GoPro so... Just caught two on the chatter bait. They really want it going slow though. How's that for garbage? How's that for absolutely trash? Come on, focus, baby. Look at that. Just broken. Just broke, right? What? What is that? Well, I got more chatter baits in the truck, but in the meantime, I got a couple other tricks up my sleeve. Hey, drive a little slower so I can. Uh, Talk to the Grand Season Outdoor fans, please. Jerk bait. I mean, it's winter. How much better can you get? KVD jerkbait has some rattles in it. I can hear that thing rattling from shore right now. Oh. I think I just got smacked. That was that same area. I'm just giving it one, this is how I'm fishing it, one pole like that, two poles with long pauses because this water is so cold. And then I give it three, and then I work my way back down. I go two, long pause, give it one, work my way back up, two, that's about all for that fast, but kind of give you guys an idea of how I'm working my jerk bait really long pauses with this cold water because they do not want it going fast
was wondering if that would work. That's a real small one. Wow, he's skinny for a pre-spawner too. That's like a half pounder, but I was wondering if that would work. What I did there, I just made an adjustment because I, I, I knew they would eat a jerk bait. I just knew it had to be something with me. So what I did is let him go before this car comes by. I'm gonna try to talk real quick, but what I did was just smaller, smaller jerks. No, so basically, this is what my this is what my jerk looked like when I started. I was going like that, and then right there, I was just just real little twitches because I I remembered that they really wanted that chatter bait slow. So just a little adjustment there. See if that produces some more fish. Keep throwing the jerk bait a little bit. And we'll try to use that uh, the smaller jerks, just little, just real little twitches. Oh, no way! Oh, that must have been a pike. No. No, that was a nice jerk bait. Oh no. Oh, that just got hammered. Oh, that just got smacked. No, no, no. Alright, I'm gonna go retie. Oh, that really sucks. That was a nice fish. That destroyed it. It must have been a pike. He, he must have hit the head sideways to cut the line like that. All right, we are back in action. More natural colored kind of bait fish, chatter bait with the gold blade. Same exact jerk bait. Whatever that was, smoked it. I'm guessing there's a pike swimming around here with a KVD sexy shad jerk bait sideways in its mouth, so. That sucks, but. Oh. Smoked it. First cast of it. Like I said, you guys. I literally just said early, like right before I shut the camera off to go re-rig. I made a switch. I switched to those smaller little jerks, more twitches honestly than anything. And we start catching fish on the jerk bait. I went from like 20 casts with no fish to like the last three casts have all gotten bit since I switched my cadence. Right now, I'm gonna tell myself to slow down on this one. Oh, good fish. Smoked it. Two pounder at least. Oh, yeah. T boned it. He's got that KVD jerk bait sideways in his mouth. Her mouth, probably. Huh. Two pounder, probably. No complaints there, baby. God, I love it. I love it. I'm finding, God, I got the itch. I need the summer. I need all this ice to come off. was not very graceful but what can you do you live and you learn I'm not gonna chuck the next one in I know in the comments I'm gonna get ripped for that and I feel bad about it myself so go ahead and take your shots literally was just saying to the camera though I was just saying I can feel myself starting to speed up I get excited I want to reel fast. I just told myself, long pauses, slow twitches, get T-boned. 
by one and a half two pounder. Little guy. Little guy, same thing though. Hit it sideways. I don't even know how many I've caught. It's five or six maybe? This little half pounder. Got the front hooks. Front hooks in his jaw. Little guy. Guys, this is insane. This is literally nuts. That is a pre spawn fatty. This is a short fish, and it's got to be a pound and a half. Oh, please don't shake, or I'm getting troubles in my hand. Troubles in my hand. Yeah, pound. Pound maybe, but real fat. This is absolutely nuts. I went, I'm gonna say it again. I'm gonna keep repeating myself. I went like 20, 25 casts. Nothing. Not even a bite. Maybe got hit once over here. Slowed it way down. I'm catching a fish every other cast. Barely hooked. Kind of worried about that happening. Well, this guy's all dirty. Been rolling in the mud. Holy crap. Things looks looks like a northern tried to take a chunk out of it. But another one. Let's see if I got this angled right. Mm -hmm. That looks decent. I mean, I look like a goon, but as long as the grind season outdoors fans are happy, I'm happy. You guys should comment. Comment what you like better. The GoPro angle on the head, usually I'll be wearing it on the chest. Or the big camera. Big camera quality is definitely going to be way better, but maybe you like this, this third person. Wait. No, first person. Maybe you like this first person view a little better. Or maybe you like both. Just comment down below which camera angle is best. All right, this is gonna be my last cast with the jerk bait, and then thinking that I'm gonna see if I can catch something on a different bait. Oh, smacked it! T-boned it again. Not very big, but catching numbers and these Mississippi River fish up here. 
northeast Iowa. I mean, they don't get huge, so definitely no complaints. So I'm in the gap between ice fishing and open water, and I'm catching fish, so I'm cool with it. All right, let's go back to what started it all. The ch -ch 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 chatter bay. That's a good one. That's a good one. Oh yeah. Oh, two pounder. Look at how he ate that chatterbait. That is a short two pounder. Holy crap. Look at that. And up north, they just got the little mouths. release on this nice fish. Alright. Gonna go tie on another jerk bait and get out of here. That glare and that shadow, that's whatever. I'm gonna film this outro quick. Uh, today was amazing. I mean, I don't know if I'll find a spot like that. I truly don't know if I'll find a spot like that for the rest of the year. Like, catching like 20 fish out of a little tiny hole like that, that's nuts. Especially this time of year, considering all the water is freezing cold. There was ice on that entire slough except for that little corner. Two baits, two baits that were the money makers. KVD shallow diving. That was the shorter version, the shallow diving jerk bait, sexy shad. And then that uh that chatter bait. Oh, of course a train drives by right when I'm doing my outro. Make this quick. Chatter bait with the gold blade, kind of a smoky minnow kind of color. Uh, definitely, I broke that off. Broke my chartreuse chatterbait. Lost both my KVD sexy shad jerk baits to northerns. So definitely going to have to buy some more lures. But I've got something really exciting to show you guys before I end this. This is pretty sick. But I'm here, like on the river, this little little town on the river here. This is about 50 minutes from my house. Check this out. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, that lighting's terrible, but look at that. Oh, baby. That would be. Ooh, ooh, that sick angle. That would be the cabin that my grandparents are building right now here on the river. So, this summer, spending a ton of time here. We're fishing. Grind season outdoors. Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. Like it, share it, subscribe.